Well, one year from now, that's the date you'll want to put in your calendar. Toledo will be in the line of a total solar eclipse. Yeah, to give us a better look at where this blackout will be cast next year on April 8th is meteorologist Ryan Weekman. Hard to believe we're one year away from this solar eclipse and I wanted to give you an update on what we're talking about here, the stories that you can find right now at WTOL.com. And over the course of the next year, you're going to find a lot of these stories right here. This is how we record videos and send them over to you on our WTOL 11 weather app. Yes, not just for the forecast, but for stories like the solar eclipse to keep you updated. If you don't have it, give it a free download here myself all of our team and meteorologists in the WTOL 11 Weather Center throughout the year will be publishing stories on here. And if you have the app, you'll be the first to see them. Now, obviously, we still have quite some time before the eclipse right. arrives, but the excitement of this one here is going to be something we haven't had in quite some time. Parts of Northwest Ohio, just a sliver of southeastern Michigan included in the path of totality. And what's amazing about this eclipse is how fast it's moving in the night, um, the afternoon sky here. We're talking from start to finish just across the state of Ohio. It's going to do that in seven minutes and 26 seconds. So you got to really hone in on this next April. You've got one chance here. The last time we had a total solar eclipse in Ohio, 1806 to hit our area. The next one isn't until the end of this century. So this will be your one shot to check it out here again. Give it a, an app download right here, the WTOL 11 weather app, not just for forecasts, but for science and eclipse information throughout the year.